Hello, this is Michelle Knight. Now, you're gonna have to forgive me. I'm blaming Mercury, but can you hear that noise? That is my central heating. I have poked it, I have smacked it, I have cajoled it, but it won't turn off. So if you hear this <laughs> through here, you know why. Anyway, here's your weekly astrology. This week, we're all feeling very passionate and confident about what we want to say as the sun is conjunct Mercury, but Mercury's retrograde. So listen up, here's your weekly astrology. Sagittarius, it's all about you. Yeah, baby, just so you like it. You're feeling frisky, you're feeling free, you're feeling wild, you're feeling spontaneous, you're feeling adventurous, and you're seeing new pathways open ahead of you. Having said that, you might be tumbling uh, like in the spin dryer of life as Mercury is going retrograde. So you're like, rah, where are the brakes? Or someone take the brakes off, I'm ready to go, go, go. Trust that whatever you want will come at the right moment. Do the work this week, but trust it. There's a lot of interesting love stuff going on this week. A lot of things to be sorted out, but nothing may be as spontaneous as you would like it because of the Mercury retro. But it's not here for long, so chill out and enjoy the ride. Firstly, on the 13th, the sun is in your sign is joining Mercury in your sign. So you're feeling very positive. If you do bump into anyone from the past, you're like, yes, this is me. Aren't I fabulous? You're able to strut your stuff and good for you. Yeah, particularly if you, you might meet someone that made you insecure or they felt they were better than you or you felt insecure and actually it wasn't their stuff and you're able to be more balanced in that connection. Venus is trying the mystical North Node and there may be an overseas attraction or you decide out of the blue that you want to travel somewhere even if it involves saving and that could be a, a, a place that's like a a soul empowerment place there are certain places in the world that when we go there we are like a different person or, or we just feel that we've come home for me that's la actually which is really odd because i never would have thought that it would be la that would be one of those places and also venice so you might not have even been to the place that's your soul home but there's something coming to you and in that place, you may even meet a lover or something shifts in your emotional dynamics, your romantic dynamics. We have Mercury also joining forces with Venus in your sign. Oh, yeah. You know, you are a love magnet this week. Uh, maybe an ex gets in touch because Mercury's retrograde. Venus is there. Or it may be that you just feel that it now is the time for love. May not happen immediately, may happen at the end of the month, but love is all around you as the old song goes. We also have the sun trying Uranus, the unexpected, and good for you because the sun in your sign is trying is, is trying Uranus, is bringing you a very pleasant surprise because it's in your creativity, passion, soulmate zone. All in all, I think this week could bring you joy and fabulous fingers crossed happy birthday um, for now or before and i take care and i'll speak to you soon hello wonderful one thank you so much for listening it would be fabulous if you liked subscribed or shared it would be really really helpful also i have a ton of free stuff for you horoscope.co.uk for everything astrology and michellenight.com for everything psychic and free tarot reading see you there